what happened with you and Jack Evans? Ah, we have a fight. We have a fight back then in Mexico. But uh, but we always cool. We cool, super cool now. I book him into my shows. <laughs> you know, I give him work now. You know, it's like I'm not. I'm not. I'm, a, I'm not one of those guys. Like, oh, I'm gonna have this bad feeling in me. You know, forever. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. That's terrible. I mean, I, and I feel bad even to say fuck that. It's yeah. terrible to say even fuck that. You know, that's awful. Did you have many backstage fights in your career? Uh, I have one with him, and I have another one with uh, mm, Rest in Peace. Uh, uh, Abismo Negro was oh. a it was an old timer luchador in Mexico. I have a big fight with him in the locker room. Yeah. What was that all about? Just, our, you know, he 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 disrespect me. In in a, in a way that I I would I would I was not able to 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 step back. You know, it's, there's limit, right? So I didn't step back and and I find the motherfucker. Everybody was surprised. They were like fuck, who is fighting this motherfucker? He was bigger, bigger than me, stronger than me. Fuck this guy. Don't nobody respect when you when when you know I'm not a fighter guy. Or to be honest, I'm not. I'm a very like peaceful guy and I've been learning that you know right now I'm a more than I'm a polity guy you know I, I'm, I'm a I like to to you know to put the ideas in the table and to to be able to confront and to make facts and, and to to work with them 